what's up? It's Lauren, your friendly neighborhood gaijin, and happy new year! It's officially 2019! So today, I went on a little adventure with my friend, and we went into a shopping center called Aeon Town in Sukagawa, Fukushima Prefecture, and the Japanese people have these things called fukubukuro, which means lucky bag. So basically, it is a bag full of kind of mystery items from the shops and usually the bags are worth a lot more than what they're selling them for so it's think like Black Friday but at New Year's and you don't know what you're getting <laughs> I got three bags because I'm crazy so I got my first bag here is a Twinkle Star bag! I don't know if you know Twinkle Star, but um, it's these cute little twin characters, a boy and a girl, Kiki and Lala, and so I'm very excited. So this one cost me 2,000 yen, so about $20, um, but let's open it up and see what I got! Ooh. All right, so I gotta put it on the floor because this thing is actually really big. Okay, so the first thing that I have here is a Mickey Mouse calendar! Woo! So it's a 2019 wall calendar it looks like. Um, and there's little stickers on the back that show like vacation and birthdays and everything. So that's the first item. So this alone would probably be like five dollars, right? Um, the next thing is... oh. <gasps> is a lap blanket. So it's got little like Boston Terrier French Bulldog dogs on it and I just noticed the tag and this alone is eighteen dollars so it's one thousand eight hundred yen which is about eighteen bucks so this alone was pretty much worth it just for the bag. So let's move on. Oh I see princess! Oh, I got a Rapunzel towel! Rapunzel's actually a really big character here in Japan. A lot of the girls wear um, like Rapunzel style dresses and they always go with her for Halloween. So this is kind of exciting. I wonder if the price is on this one at all. It's not, but this would probably be about three or four dollars. Um, ooh, I think I got a mug. I did get a mug. Yes, I am a dog lover! Oh! Excellent. Let's see what we got. If we got a cat or a dog one. Oh, we got a cat one. Yes, I am a cat lover. So this is the mug that I got. And you can see all these different things here. Health food for cats. Special water makes cats beautiful. Canned skipjack tuna. What is diet? Oh, this cat understands me. What is diet? put that back. So this is a really small mug. Mugs in Japan for some reason always tiny. I don't get it. And then I think there's one. Oh, no. Nope. Now we have a smaller bag inside the big bag. So let's see what's inside this bad boy. So I think this is going to be more like stationary stuff. Maybe. Okay. Holy jeez Louise. There's so much in here. Okay, the first thing that I saw is what looks like a pencil case. Hashtag fun! <laughs> Hashtag fun! <laughs> so that's really cute. It's really big too. So that's a pencil case. Oh, an, um oh, an umbrella! Wow! So this alone would be like six bucks. Let's open it and see the pattern. So the pattern looks like little little bows along the edges there. So that's really cute and it's nice and small so you can keep it in your purse for those rainy day emergencies. Ooh, one, two things. Right, I see a couple of like loose things like I got an eraser and then Oh, a pencil, a Peanuts Snoopy pencil. I don't know if you can see that. It'll focus or not. Snoopy. And then I got this, which I think is like a highlighter or a pen. 
yeah, it's a red marker. So that's really pretty. I feel like Sailor Mars. Mars. The oh, there's one more. <gasps> Got two pencils. Oh, I love these kind of pencils that have the little bits on the end here. So this one's really like sweets and breakfast, like cafe style stuff. And this one just says, let's go, best choice, with a panda. Hello, panda bear. <laughs> that, I see something Spider-Man in here. Oh, Spider-Man buttons! <laughs> Spider-Man homecoming buttons. <laughs> Those are going up my backpack for sure. I really like the new Spider-Man. Um, okay. So I got what looks like a little notepad, uh, and there's two different styles. So it looks like a little pommel horse type style here, one, two, three, that they usually have in like traditional anime and stuff. And then just a regular little notepad here. Looks like a chalkboard. So that's really cute. Uh, yeah, so this alone is like 250 yen, so I'm already way over what I have in the first bag. Oh, I got really pretty stickers. I don't know if you can see. Candy seal flake image. So it looks like a camera, some toast, drinks, desserts. These are really cute. Oh, and I can use those to seal up the letter set that I got in here. Holy jeez. This is 400 yen. So this is like 4 or $5 in and of itself. And there's five different styles. So if we look up here, we've got this one, a pretty yellow, pretty ribbons, jewels and stuff, and then the nice green one down here that I'm kind of looking forward to. It's called Harmony Heart. So if you want a letter, let me know. I have lots now. <laughs> and we're still not done. So we have a ruler, a little ruler that says style. It's got these two cool girls on it. So that'll come in handy. Oh my goodness. An actual like... So this is a drawing notebook. And it's actually got a cute little handle on it. And then it's just blank pages inside. And it's Meltree Cat. Believe in miracles. Keep going after your dreams. Everything will be all right. What good advice for 2019. Oh, one more Spider-Man thing. <laughs> so I forget what these are called, but um, a lot of the kids use them for their notebooks. So what they do is they take their notebook and they open it to a page and then they put this in and it makes it hard for writing so it helps their printing and things oh, I forget what they're called though, my kids just told me they got new ones and then, ooh. oh, a Barbie folder, multi pocket folder, it's all Barbie, it's got lipstick and Barbie's face, shoes, hearts, lip smooches and then it's multi pocketed wow what a freaking, oh wait, there's one last thing in here. All right, so the last thing from the first bag is a cute little strap. It's a keychain for, oh, keychain for bicycles. So it's a keychain for bicycles. And there's a little bell on it. I don't know if you can hear it. There's a bell. Holy gee, so that was the first bag and that was the $20 bag. So, oh my goodness. Let's open another one, because I have three. I went a little crazy. Okay, so now it's time for bag number two. So it's actually a backpack. So it's a Little Mermaid backpack. Hang on, let me open it. And apparently there's more things inside, which is basically the only reason why I bought it. Now this one was also like $21, but the backpack itself alone would have been quite quite expensive. So it's a Little Mermaid design and I'm gonna have to break this somehow. Ow! I don't know where my scissors are. So they had like this one, I think they had like um, the Toy Story Little Green Men, a couple other things, but I like this one the best because Little Mermaid! <laughs> my favorite Disney princess. Okay so inside, oh it's all Ariel stuff it looks like! <gasps> That's so exciting! So it looks like I have a little aerial storage box. You can see the design on it. The mermaids and aerial. And then a towel. So 
So it's Spirit Bright on this towel. Spirit Bright. That. Another towel. Oh, this is actually a blanket. This is like a little flea slap blanket, which is also super cute. Let's see if you can see. Up like that. A rainbow under the sea. So there's that little, I'm going to put that on my lap right now. <laughs> and then, I think there's one more. What is this? And then this is the last thing in here. And it's a cushion. Oh, cool. I'm actually not going to open it because it's air sealed right now, so it's staying really flat. Um, but yeah, it looks like a little pillow. That's so cute. And it says adorable Ariel on it. <laughs> so cute. This is exciting because now I have a bag to carry all my stuff in. Yay, all from my three bags. So I have one bag left, and this is the one I paid the most money for. Um, so this is the Sumiko Gudashi bag. Now the thing with a lot of Fukubukuros is that they come in these really nice, like, sturdy, reusable bags. So this is actually like a really nice little tote bag that I could carry stuff in. Um, like this alone is worth probably at least 10 bucks for the bag itself. So let's open it, see what we got. So this is going to be a lot of Sumiko Gudashi stuff, I think. So, oh, look at that. I got another cushion, a Sumiko Gudashi cushion. So they're all kind of in the doorway. That's really cute. Oh, it kind of looks similar to the Ariel bag where I have a little storage box of Sumiko, which is perfect because I need more storage in my apartment. I also need to just clean it and go through everything, but that's for another day. Ooh, I got another lap blanket of Sumiko Gurashi. Lap blanket. Oh, I got a little bento case. This is so cute. I think there's actually another one inside. Let's open that and see. Let's open it up. Shoop. And there's... Oh my god, it's like Matryoshka dolls. Shoop. A little yellow one. This is so cute. I love this. Put those back inside. I have new lunchware for the new year. Woohoo! I mean, I'm pretty sure it's for kids, but maybe if I ate a big breakfast. Don't know. Um, oh, there's a mug in this one too. Or what I can only imagine is a mug. Ooh. Yeah, it's a pretty good size. Um, it's got all the Sumiko characters. So this one's actually my favorite. It's a little blue lizard thing. Ooh, the edge is kind of rough, so I bet that's why it was... So this is kind of like all their end of season, end of the year, big sale stuff that they haven't sold a lot of throughout the year, and they just keep it, and then people go crazy for it. And then the last thing in here is... Oh! A drawstring backpack. <laughs> So that's really interesting. And I know none of these have actual prices on them. It looks like all the prices off these ones were taken off, but I can tell you right now that this mug was probably like eight bucks. And the drawstring backpack, probably around five. The blanket, the cushion, it's all really good stuff. So that's why they're called lucky bags, because all the bags I think have like a minimum value and some have more than that and I think this one did so that's it for my lucky bag haul thanks for joining me I hope you enjoyed it I'm hoping that next year if I'm around I'll be able to get a Pokemon Center one from the Sendai Pokemon Center and I can do a video of that because I saw one of my friends opening theirs today and I was super jealous so hopefully next year we can do that, but thanks for joining me. I know it's been a while since I posted a video, but don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe, and hit the bell button to get alerted to when I do post new videos. Happy New Year, everybody!